You know, I used to say, let's try laser therapy. Let's give it five to six treatments, see if we're seeing any improvement at all. But I don't even say that anymore. We find dogs are not only getting better faster, but they're recovering stronger, less muscle atrophy, less compensation in the other limb. You know, we're decreasing their pain, we're decreasing the inflammation, and then we're healing the area. We started using it just a little bit in the equine side. We did not realize how much it was going to take off. I actually started using it on my own personal horse. People would comment on how good he looked and how clean his legs and joints were. And then I would explain what I was doing. And then they'd say, well, can you come look at my horse? And I'd go look at their horse and they'd say, well, we've got this fetlock or this hawk. And then we'd use the laser and it would help with the swelling, with range of motion. Not only would the lameness go away, but the horse's performance would improve. We know that it's safe. We know that it's not painful. We know it's not causing damage. And so that's nice knowing that that research is available to know that I can tell a client there are not bad side effects. I'm not worried about using this. In the small animal world, we, we always talk about a dog that was hit by a car when she was a year old. And since then, she's had back pelvis arthritis. She's had multiple treatments directly in the spine. And now at 12 years old, she got to the point where she couldn't walk at all anymore. The owners were very ready to say goodbye. And someone said, try laser therapy, try acupuncture. Let's see what happens. After two weeks of treatment with acupuncture and laser together, she started walking again and it's been four months and she's still walking. We say that's our amazing case.